the heavy-duty trucks that were diverted through Willis will now have one less worry while traversing through this area. So too will residents and motorists who use the road daily after Friday of this week. Due to the Molinier Road slippage and the area being designated a sub-national disaster zone, the road in Willis became the highway for heavy-duty trucks as well as garage trucks coming from the Perseverance landfill. Project Coordinator for Consolidated Contractors Company, CCC, Rawlson Bolin says, recognizing the increased flow of traffic due to the new asphalt plant in Perseverance, they decided to make the journey easier for everyone. So we volunteer to extend this culvert for the government and people, and we're also going to excavate this portion of this land so the traffic could be viewed properly from one end of the road to the other end of the road. The work began on Saturday with the deadline for completion this Friday and the project coordinator says CCC is absorbing all the cost. Okay, because this, this portion of this road is under the Kuwaiti funds that the road have to continue from out there to join back. If you notice, CCC had did the whole um, Grenville-Ville Road to stop there. So this is our next phase. Then the asphalt plant, we have a new asphalt plant. So materials will be coming on 40-foot containers and so. So when we do our traffic protocol, we realize that we must repair here. So we could not have waited on Ministry of Works. So we volunteer and they say, OK, in globalization, let us do it again. Two motorists welcome the initiative. I think it's good enough because the corner, you know, it was bumpy, big hole. So I think they're doing a good work. So I know it was good because that corner is dangerous. I guess that's a, that's a very important piece of road right there because it's, we have to go to um, Perseverance and those places there, you know. So it's, it's very good. It's very good. I'm kind of busy. It's very good. It's, it's a very good piece of road. All right? According to Mr. Bullen, the road is sinking and very narrow, with the heavy equipment passing adding to the danger. I am Gerard Joseph for GBN News.